Hi. As you may know, I've been struggling with my hair lately. And in my last couple of videos, we discovered some things that were very eye-opening. So I've started to get serious about my hair care. I've never really been one for buying fancy hair products, but it occurred to me that the bog standard shampoo and conditioner just aren't going to cut it anymore. After my last videos, I had hundreds of recommendations for products and brands, and it was becoming a little overwhelming. But then I stumbled across a brand called Revive. I reached out, I explained my hair problems, and they advised me on what products would be best for my hair. They also very kindly sent me some of their products to try for you. And they've given you a 20% discount when you use the code Isabella. So it's been a month and here's the lowdown on Revive. So what's so special about Revive? Well, they're actually first and foremost a skincare product for the scalp. So in their words, they target the hair at follicle level to preserve its healthy state and promote the growth of stronger, healthier hair. So first in their three-part system starter kit, we have Prep, a deep cleansing and exfoliating shampoo. Then we have Prime, deep moisturizer and conditioner. Their representative told me that it was in research and development for three years prior to release and contains over 30 different peptides that are beneficial for the hair. It works to rebalance the pH of the scalp skin, that's what I like to hear, add strength and moisture to the hair follicles and strands and maintain scalp health. So I do use this conditioner on my scalp as well and I was instructed to leave this in for four minutes. So I use this time to do all my other shower stuff. Now Mend is a deep repair mask which doesn't come with the kit but it was recommended to me for my problems with split ends and frizz. So I'm using it to supplement the normal hair washing routine with the kit and this should be left on for three minutes. The last step in the kit is Treat which is a scalp rejuvenation and protection serum. It works to increase circulation and add additional vitamins and nutrients directly to the scalp and allow follicles to grow healthier hair. Its natural peptides will promote hair growth and won't hurt your hair in any way, so you spray this all over your scalp, massage it in, and you don't need to wash it out. Oh, and by the way, I'm going to be sharing my measurements at the end of this video to see if this promoted any hair growth. I used the process you just saw every time I washed my hair for one whole month and I used no other products. I was instructed to use this system three to four times a week. This was not doable for my routine, so I used it twice a week. So here you can see when I started Revive, how many times I washed my hair, how many times I air dried my hair, blow dried, straightened, heatless straightened, and the days I took footage of my hair. Just FYI, I've only just started occasionally straightening my hair on a very low heat, just when I want it to look nice for something. I've never straightened my hair regularly throughout my life, so no, my current hair issues are not due to heat damage. So this is my hair the morning after my first wash using the products. I had just let it air dry the night before and I'd put all my hair in a silk cap and gone to bed. And even though it's a little bit messy, I actually was really enjoying how lively and bouncy it was. And the fact that my hair was all clumping together rather than all fraying out how it usually does. This was a week and a half later. This is two days after a wash and I had blow dried it and I'd heatlessly straightened it two days prior to this. So you can see a video on how I heatlessly straighten my hair. I'll leave it in the video. Um, so I was really happy with it this day. It was super smooth. It was just a good hair day and it actually looked like normal straight hair, which my hair never looks like. So I was really pleased with how my hair was progressing. The next two weeks I was actually on a theatre tour. So my surroundings kind of changed a little bit and uh, it was kind of hard for me to film but I tried to do the best I could. So this is the day after and this was my favorite hair day. This was like the best my hair had ever been. This was actually third day hair so my hair was a little greasy but it was so smooth, so shiny, so sleek and really straight and it was just behaving. It looked like I'd styled it or something but I'd honestly just woken up after having my hair in a silk cap and three days previously I had heatlessly straightened. So this is how my hair was looking on third day. I loved it. What I also like about their products is they use natural ingredients derived from plants. The products are alcohol free, drug free, they contain no parabens, no sodium, they're hypoallergenic and they're 
they're always cruelty free. Now this is just under a week later. This is what my hair looks like after a wash and air dry and it was pretty warm in the place we were staying so it might have been kind of like the radiators that made it kind of really frizzy but um, I was still using the products just the same as before but this is what it looks like when it air dries. But you can see that it's really, really super shiny still and it was very soft to the touch so even though it's still drying quite frizzy you can see each strand is actually quite shiny it's got a lot more luster to it all their products have a ph range of 5 to 6.5 depending on the product which i'm very happy to see i made a video all about hair ph so make sure you watch that after this video it's linked below so this is the morning after that day after sleeping in a silk cap just my hair all down in the silk cap so you can see that it's really tamed the frizz out and um, the shine of it and the silkiness is really more visible this morning. This was a couple days after the day after washing and air drying and I'd actually put my hair like in a clip I'd like twisted it and put it in a clip to try and tame the frizz but I actually didn't like how it looked after because it made all these kinks in my hair so it wasn't a very good hair day but other than that it's still very shiny and you can see how smooth it is and then a week after that I was back home and this is after a wash and air dry and having worn braids overnight there's a few like waves in it from the braids but it's still pretty smooth and shiny so that brings us up to now and I've decided to voice over this footage because I feel like I wasn't making a whole lot of sense but essentially with one side of my hair I'd sort of roughly blow dried it and then left the rest to air dry and with the other side of my hair I'd styled it using my big um like hair dry roller thingy. This is what my hair looked like a couple months before after trying to blow dry it with a round brush and a hair dryer. And as you can see, even though I had attempted to blow dry it straight and nice, uh, it still just looks like a mess. Like it's straight, but it's so frizzy and dull. There's no shine or luster to it. So although my hair is still drying kind of crazy, I'd say that my hair is behaving much better whenever I try to style it and that goes for heatless styling, that goes for um, blow drying it with the roller thing. So I was just quite happy with the way it looked this day. This is what my hair looks like from the back after being roughly air dried and you can see it's still got a long way to go. It needs a good old trim but overall I'm very happy with the progress of my hair in just one month of using Revive. It's also grown quite a bit. So when I started Started, my hair measured 13.2 inches from the tip of my earlobe to the ends of my hair and after a month of using Revive my hair measures 14 inches. The average hair growth in a month is half an inch so it's actually grown more than the average hair growth while using these products. Interesting. Let's look at price range. These are what I'd describe as specialized hair products. So they are dearer than your bog standard. However, they're not as expensive as a lot of other products I came across. So I've put some price conversions up for you. And if you didn't wanna buy the whole kit, but you just wanted to buy the conditioner, for example, it's around $32.95, which is 25 pound 27, approximately. My verdict. Honestly, I've really enjoyed using these products. I feel like they're more nourishing than my normal hair products that I use. And I do feel like it has changed the overall look and feel of my hair. I genuinely feel like I've had more good hair days than bad hair days. Like it used to be that every day would just be a bad hair day. It's just had a lot more luster and bounciness. It just seems to be brought to life a little bit more. So Revive Pro Care gets the seal of approval from me. You can check out all of their products in the description. If you have any products you'd like me to try out for you in a future video, do leave a comment. Follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, Depop, Twitter. I'm also an actor, so all my acting socials will be below. Also, P.S. I'm currently so ill, so my voice is so probably sounding a little raspy bit more quiet today so I feel like it's given a little bit of a more relaxing vibe so if you're watching this in the evening I hope I haven't sent you to sleep anyway thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye